take our lead, let's help you make your mark. Our goal is your satisfaction. Let us show you the way. Starting from the faucet side and moving toward the frozen area, slowly heat the pipes with a hair dryer, electric heating pad, heat lamp, or portable space heater. Never use an open flame to thaw frozen pipes. Point 2 February 2017. Let's help you make your mark. Connect your hose to the tap and begin running hot water into the pipe. Slowly feed the hose through the pipe as the ice melts. Once the pipe is completely thawed, remove the hose and immediately repair the pipe. Afterwards, try to keep water running through the pipe to reduce the risk of refreezing. Take our lead. Open faucets and valves connected to the frozen water pipe so that water can flow when it begins to thaw. Determine the extent of the freezing. Heat the pipe with a hair dryer if the freezing is more extensive. Keep heating the pipe until water begins to flow from the faucet. Let's help you make your mark. Blue water supply MDPE should be laid in a trench at a depth of at least 750 mm, measured from the pipe crown, but no more than 1,350 mm, from the finished ground level and at least 350 mm away from other utilities, such as gas or electricity. Let's help you make your mark. For PVC piping systems that are buried underground, sunlight won't be a problem, but debris, soil movement, and freezing temperatures may be. While PVC is more flexible than other materials, it does still have a breaking point, and it's often soil movement that can cause it to fail. Point 9 January 2020. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and hit the bell notification.